New York City is known for having some of the most spectacular sights and attractions. But there are also some great unknown spots, whether out of the way or intentionally secret. I made it my mission to uncover some of Manhattan's New York's Fashion Week is gym. once again upon us. And this year, Kimora Lee Simmons' Baby Fat Show got it all started. The urban collection that combines street fashion with style Wake has up, always well, stood out. That's right. We have some rain headed our direction. Also some snow some folks will see around our area tomorrow during the day. Let's go right about what's happening on the roads right now. Good morning, everybody. Up to Jim Smith in Chopper 2, still above a big problem spot in the Bedminster area. We're, We're going to hear all Beach about Fever Week here on CBS. We're all looking forward to hitting the sand this summer, but sometimes getting there can be an event in and of itself. This week, We're bringing you all the good stuff that won't cost you a dime. First up is fitness. Yep, there's no excuse about the cost of a gym membership because we found it free. Sasha Cohen is here teaching me how to skate. That's quite the honor. Now bend and pull up. Okay, here we go. And pull up! Is still here because we're worried that the, maybe the big cat had eaten the little ones. But that was Mama Cat, I think, wasn't was it? Was that what that was, Vanessa? That, that was actually a boy cat, Mr. Big oh. Stuff, I'm calling him. His Mr. name's Big Hermes. Stuff. We'll, ch we'll check Big in with stuff. him in a minute. But he did not eat the little cats, although he was a little camera shy. Um, NewYork.com, we're all about staying in shape. But we realize that sometimes that's a tough task. So we found some great products that will help you meet your fitness goals. We're going to start <laughs> <Man> shape <laughs> Choreography too. Nice, long. she remembers the choreography from the movie. That is hysterical. Time now for my favorite segment, the Angelpreneurs with Bumps and Blunders. Let's go, Vanessa, what's your bump? Amazon and Kindle, they reported that they're selling more yeah. e-books yeah. than ever, more e-books than regular books in the last three months, and 80% more in the last month. Dot com. You, you run a dot com. Exactly. Good idea, bad idea. What's it's the story? a great idea. I mean, first of all, who doesn't love a great deal? People are phenomenal in and of itself. They're a great, innovative company. They do great things. So I'm not surprised that they're, they're coming out with this now. I'm surprised they didn't yeah. do it sooner. Good morning and welcome back. Let's talk about your forecast for today. Right now, Sky Guardian shows not a whole lot happening. You definitely don't want to be outside for too long, and if you do have to be outside you want to make sure that you are bundled up because it sure is cold out there grab the sunglasses on the way out the door the temperatures right now in the 40s and 50s and the breakdown for the day looking pretty good 73 degrees the expected high here in manhattan plenty of sunshine we're going to dip back down during the five days but we'll have lots of sunshine i'll talk more about the five-day forecast coming up fox 5's vanessa alfano in the middle of the cleanup and how's it looking vanessa well, it definitely is in need of a cleanup, that's for sure. The police actually have Bay Ridge Avenue blocked off. We're here at the corner of Bay Ridge and 3rd Avenue. The police not allowing any vehicles through. This pretty much sums up just how strong that tornado was that ripped through uh, Bay Ridge, Brooklyn, and parts of Sunset Park and other areas of Brooklyn as well. And Con Ed is urging uh, residents in this area to not use excessive power and also to cooperate with all the efforts that the police are making. In this area, though, very, very prone to flooding. Just days ago, we saw several feet of water gather below some of the overpasses. Take a look at some of the video of this truck plowing through. So you may want to opt for the trains. The trains are all on time, uh, on or close to schedule on New Jersey Transit, Metro North, and the LIRR. We'll keep you posted on the situation here.